was kind of life-threatening at the time. Uh, I mean, anybody in that situation would be scared. She says she was sexually abused for years because of her own family. Now her parents are owning up to their roles in her troubling childhood. Good evening, I'm Andrew Kinsey. And I'm Brittany Bailey. And for Yolanda tonight, the parents of that Athens County girl who accused her parents of failing to stop her sexual abuse in her own home pleaded guilty to two felonies. It's a story 10 TV broke three days ago. And tonight we have new details. Our Kevin Landers was in the courtroom. After spending 10 months in jail, Robert and Deborah Beller are now headed to prison. Robert will get three years behind bars, his wife four years. Both pled guilty to crimes involving their daughter. 54-year-old Robert Beller and his wife, 49-year-old Deborah Beller, decided it was time to put their criminal case behind them and admit to the crimes against them. And you understand that at that jury trial, the state of Ohio has the burden of proving every element of the offenses against you beyond a reasonable doubt. Yes, Your Honor. Yes, sir. With their daughter, Sarah, looking on, the Bellers both pled guilty to engaging in a pattern of corrupt activity and endangering children. Sarah Beller claimed that two of her brothers had sexually assaulted her. Her parents, she says, knew about the abuse but did nothing to stop it. Prosecutors say they also tried to conceal the crimes from authorities trying to investigate. Sarah Beller's attorney says the plea provided his client with some form of vindication, considering the emotional and physical trauma she endured. She's been through hell and uh, suffered catastrophic damages. This case is not over. The Bellers are also named in a federal civil lawsuit in which Sarah's attorney says the Bellers, along with county officials, ignored Sarah's pleas for help. Reporting from Athens County, Kevin Landers, 10TV News. Sarah Beller, through the prosecutor, told the judge the case robbed her of her childhood. The prosecutor said Deborah Beller is serving more prison time because she did more to obstruct the investigation than her husband did. Now